Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. How are you guys? I hope you're good. And I want to show a really good year because probably this is my first video from 2023. Full of accomplishment and everything that you dream or wish for to become true. And uh, going back to the subject of this video, uh, I also want to mention from the beginning that this is not the original introduction of the original video because apparently one part of my video has been corrupted and I couldn't recover it at any chance, only if I would pay for uh, but uh, it was too expensive to pay for so I'm making uh, a new introduction of the video and um, that's gonna be about a Romanian dish um, you know guys, I, am, uh, I used to, to sometimes uh, do cooking videos and I do yeah, a variety of uh, dishes not something uh, specific of, uh, of country uh, just what I think I like a lot and uh, so but now this time is Romanian and uh, it's something that you, we all mostly make it with uh, Christmas for example also with other um, um, moments but uh, because it takes a lot it's a lot of work we mostly make it not so often so, uh, let me tell you what are the ingredients uh, because I cannot show it anymore because that's part of the video that has been corrupted and uh, I cannot help it So, you need a lot of vine leaves, of cabbage leaves but in my recipe I use um, uh, vine leaves because my boyfriend likes it more than cabbage leaves uh, You can use whatever you want uh, also depends on the taste you have and then you need ground beef meat um, depends on the quantity that you want to make I used a lot because I wanted to make a lot uh, and you also gonna see in my recipe that I make two different one that is with meat and one without meat uh, because I had to do also without meat because someone could not eat uh, with, with meat and that's possible so I made them with uh, um, uh, champignons okay and then you need uh, carrots and then you need uh, what do you need more? onion uh, we're gonna use onion and then we're gonna use also condiments like salt, pepper, uh, thyme, uh, dye I don't know, whatever you think uh, I am gonna use also an egg, that's also not necessarily uh, but I'm gonna use to make the composition a, more, a bit more formed uh, and easily to use it and also that won't gonna open that easily uh, while cooking in the pan because this will gonna be a kind of slow cooking uh, we're gonna be like, I don't know, 6 hours or more uh, uh, on the fire at this really low uh, fire for a long time so yeah it, it needs a lot of times uh, time then you go, uh, I'm gonna use also rice so uh, I'm gonna mix the only the uh, ground beef with uh, the onion and the carrot and uh, condiments and the egg and everything together I'm gonna mix it you're gonna see I'm gonna use my magic mix I don't know if you know what it is but you're gonna see soon in the video um, and uh, then um, you will have all yeah you're gonna see how do I roll them everything and I think uh, that's it what I have to say now so keep on watching to see the entire process and let me know what you think about now I'm gonna take this out and I'm gonna continue to do some magic in the magic mix but first I need to put the meat in here because I'm gonna make everything in here Oh, 
Okay, let me these in there. Now I'm gonna add the onion. Okay. Now from the carrot also. Uh, egg also. And I'm gonna add some condiments now. Salt and paper now. Paper. And let's see the magic. Start. enough here now I'm gonna move everything in another bowl because I still need to add the uh, rice I'm gonna add um, 150 grams of rice. And it looks like this, and now I'm gonna mix it. So now I mixed and I moved my place. And now I also want to try a device that I have it for some time but I never used it for this to roll it. I don't know how it works, so I'm just gonna try. So here it says how to do it. Put in grape or cabbage leaf to the home one. Put on a sheet or other stuffing, put all together. To move smoothly the slider at the forward position, ready. So it's probably says to put here the leaf, then fill it in and then move it like this. Now, I am curious. So here I have a leaf, but I'm gonna remove this.
Now I'm gonna take a spoon and I'm gonna take filling from here. Let's see if it's actually like that. Um, nothing is happening. Okay. Let's try one more time. Oh, inside, like this. I think it means like this and then it looks like this let's try one more time I'm not gonna put a lot in this one because the leaf is not that nice. And now it rolled it. Look. Let me take a plate. So it's actually working. Let's see. This one is smaller. Now these are uh, the first with meat that I made. They are pretty, pretty much, right? And now I'm gonna put them in, in, uh, in the pan and I'm gonna take you with me. So first I'm gonna put on the bottom other leaves to cover the bottom. Let's see if I have enough. Thank you. 
Okay. Now I'm gonna add speck. And I'm gonna spread it all over a little bit. And now I'm gonna put the sarmale inside. And now I'm gonna add also, yeah, how we call this, tomato puree. But this I first have to dissolve it with water so I'm putting it here water almost an accident Bay leaves, I'm gonna put a bit of bay leaves. And I'm gonna start. Well, now we have to wait till it starts boiling. And after I'm gonna cover it, but till then I'm gonna go further with one with champignons. And for the champignons, I'm gonna repeat the same thing, uh, only that I'm gonna put champignons in uh, in place for uh, meat. But I'm gonna go do the same thing. So these are the one with uh, mushrooms of, uh, or champignons. Yeah, um, yeah. they are uh, less uh, than the other one. And now I'm gonna put them also in the pan. I checked them in the meantime <clears throat> a few times but uh, the rice was not uh, well cooked so probably it will gonna cook slow till midnight we're gonna let them both of them at a uh, low temperature as you can see both of them and uh, then uh, probably we're gonna see how they look tomorrow so here I am back and um, I want to show you guys how it looks and to, sh to let you know how do we normally eat it it looked like this 
and I'm just gonna cut one for you it looks like this inside so you have a mix of uh, the carrot rice and the meat these are the ones with the uh, meat and we normally eat it with the sour cream and this is it we call it smantana in uh, Romania and this is actually not that healthy because it has a lot of fat as you can already see here 30 percent but as I told you in, in uh, as I told you in uh, the beginning of the video we don't make this so often so um, it's not really that bad if we sometimes eat this kind, this kind of sour cream but we also eat with um, we call it in Romanian Mama Liga. Uh, in Italian we they call it uh, polenta. Maybe you know it. Uh, I'm just gonna put a picture with uh, with it. But I didn't make today for uh, the this recipe because I don't have any more uh, that flour. So sorry for that. Um, so we normally mix it. So I'm gonna just do that. I'm just gonna put a bit of the sour cream here next to it and you take mm. <coughs> it's a really nice uh, nice um, mix really tasty only that I won't recommend this so often only if you make it with vegetables then it's more healthy and um, yeah we eat uh, this often uh, during time uh, of uh, win uh, during winter time <clears throat> so that was it guys for today thank you for watching don't forget to subscribe and see you in the next video bye